I'm in the Jordan Valley and this place is just amazing. But before we continue, I put a lot of effort in creating these videos for you guys from Israel, so I would really appreciate if you guys would subscribe to my YouTube channel and put a like in this video, it helps me a lot. The Jordan Valley is an important and strategic piece of land that stretches from the Sea of Galilee to the Dead Sea along the Jordan River. The Jordan Valley, as you can see, is a fantastic location for tourists that really want to connect with the land of Israel. But the reason I'm here is to help you understand better the peace plan and the security situation in Israel. Recently, the Israeli government, backed by the Trump peace plan, announced its intentions to annex the Jordan Valley and declare sovereignty over it. It caused a lot of opposition from the Palestinian leadership and the international community alike. But you would actually be surprised to hear that a lot of Palestinian people would be really happy to be under Israeli sovereignty rather than a Palestinian one because it means that their lives would become much, much better. In my opinion, there is nothing to annex and no need to declare anything. Why? It's really simple. The Jordan Valley belongs to the Jewish state historically and legally. It's part of Israel. This is where the Israelites have crossed the Jordan River into the Promised Land thousands of years ago, long before the term Palestinian was invented by the Romans. It happened long before there was such an idea called a Palestinian state. The Jordan Valley has biblical significance and archaeologists continue to find more evidence that proves the Jewish connection to this land, the land of Israel. According to the Palestinians' demands, the Jordan Valley must be a part of a future Palestine. If that happens, Israel's security will be compromised in such a way that will actually threaten our existence. That's because the Jordan Valley is Israel's longest border from the east that stops terrorists and weapon smugglers from entering Judea and Samaria, the heartland of Israel. Secondly, the valley forms a natural barrier that in biblical times stopped armies from invading into Israel and defeating Jews and other people. So to sum it all up, we are looking at the Promised Land. This is the Jewish homeland and there is nothing Palestinian about this place. Coming here was a dream of thousands of years, but we are finally thriving in our ancestral homeland. Keeping Israel safe is keeping the Jordan Valley. Doesn't matter if the Palestinians or the international community like it or not, because they are certainly not concerned about our security. Look, Israel wants peace with its neighbors, but I don't believe in giving land in exchange for peace. True peace comes in exchange for peace. So let me know in the comments what do you think about the Trump peace plan and also don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. It helps me a lot to deliver you guys the truth from Israel.